away and welcome to Zach One Other Three TV. We're back with the NCCRS after a um I think we had a break after Martinsville, I think, I believe. Uh that race was mid. Uh the cup race there was absolute garbage fest, so hopefully that doesn't happen again today. Looking at uh twenty seven laps, we'll see how it goes. Playoffs or pitchers in um, sight, so uh, we'll see how that goes. Matt MV has left the service, so he is no longer in the field. And that would put Alex Tinker above the cut line. Um, Aztec love it in on the pole, and uh, we'll see how it goes from there. A lot of points out there to be gained. Uh, we'll see how it goes. Playoffs are in a few races, so a lot of these guys are going to be very aggressive, including Pox Cozart and Ryan Cole, who are just below the cut line starting inside the top ten. We'll see how that goes. Um, got uh, Eric Monaco and Dark X Rain with me here. Uh, Dark, do you got any initial thoughts here? At the moment, I don't, but it's glad to be in Kansas. That's Dark X Rain for you. Eric Monaco. Do you got any uh, thoughts here for today? Um, I do. The fact that uh, Man V has left the server and uh, now Al now giving Alex Tinker the. Uh, Chance to uh, gain a lot of points here, but he's starting real about about pretty far from the front, but not not far from the back. But uh, he got a chance there. He's got to make some good passes and uh, got got to move, you know. And also look, the guys that are below the cut line, they're going to run aggressive. So he's got to run aggressive as well. He's he's in the clear for now, but he he's out of the he's out of the woods yet. Ain Styles currently the uh, car builds cut line. Uh, starting right behind him is the spring winner, Sam Oskin. Uh, Oskin, uh, part of the color words, I guess we could say. And, uh, other than that, not too much to discuss. Last week's winner was uh, Brock Nelson after a rather interesting race. Uh, By By Byron Webb led, got pole, led some laps. Uh, not starting so well today. That uh, team's efforts have not been too great. In fact, the last four running cars are all dodges, two of which, uh, Rail Fan Motorsports, um, one Roach Racing is a 63 of some Dan, and then um, Ferrari Row Motorsports 87 of uh, Sabre Fox, who uh, has the most wins this season. So interesting, interesting things there. And then our Homestead winner, Matthew Hill, also starting in the back. Uh, I got some work to do today at Kansas as a, the playoffs are looming. Let's see how that goes. But also another notable car star inside the top ten is Craig Pockers, who's had a pretty up and down season. We got Riley Gores, who has had speed, just hasn't found consistency. Uh, I'd say they're one to watch for the win. Marker Leonard uh, in the 66, he's definitely one to watch as well. He's not made a lot of starts. Could do something here today. And a messy in a good spot in points. Shred your points leader. Jeremy Frey, just he's not been too consistent. Uh, Anthony McClure just below the cut line. Zig Zagoon, he's being fast. Monster, who is uh, not really in contention. Ezreal Jimmer has been fast as well. A lot of stuff that could implicate the playoffs here. Uh, other than that, this is Kansas night. 27 laps. Uh, we'll see how it goes. Tests went pretty good, actually. Um, not... Um, or a little more strict on those test sessions, seeing our races have not been too up to par. I will start making sure that um, these races do stay up to par with performance of the tests. From green, getting the engine started in a little less than a minute, or a little less than half a minute, rather. Um, heard that. That's really all I got to discuss. And, uh, 72 Aztec Love it. Only teammate of Frank Chilton. So starting pole here today. Drivers, start your engines.
They just fire as they yes. head down turn yep. number three. Aztec Levette, full sitter, gets the extra point, but we'll take him anywhere. He's really low in points. Hasn't been doing so good. A win here could probably do something, but the only two races left for the playoffs, so I'll take a miracle, <laughs> maybe. Anyway, Scar will take him off of turn four on the pit road. Here we come out, turn number four. Down to the restart zone in the tri oval. Green flag, and we're underway at Kansas. Go down the back stretch there. Aztec A will take the lead. They go three wide for a second there on the bomb. That is a six six of or, or sorry the see the six is marker. Of Ozar, who, who is who is one of, below the cut line? Daytona winner. Take second. He's got Shred, the points leader, right behind him as he looks to the inside. Meanwhile, this is going to help Aztec prevent lead lap number one, now leads lap number two. Oh, crush in the back. Oh, we got trouble in the back. Caution on oh, lap number. Over. That's Brock Nelson, last week's winner. Matthew Hill involved. But Brock Nelson on his lid. He did not need this at all. This one. Let's race. see what happens. Exactly. Oh, this might hurt. Nelson translate. We look on the replay here. Here we are. Exit. Oh, four wide. They were four wide. Brock Nelson. Oh, he got tapped in the inside, right on a corner panel. The forty-three of Michael Michael O. And then he slides up, and I there doesn't know where Hill. to go. There's the 75, I believe. And he goes on his roof. On his side, and then slips. So I see Vince Freeze involved. There goes Nelson right on his lid. Oh, that is just horrible. Frank. Go from a win to spinning. Well, no, actually, more like a spin and a flip. Or a win and a spit and flip. I'm going to say it's going to be like seven cars involved, but the 51 went for a ride. From the 75. 70, 75 there, almost on his lid, but Rock Nelson oh, able to escape. Full barrel roll, and then goes Ooh. right to rest on his lid. Yeah, he doesn't stick the landing on his wheels, but that's going to end his day. Or he may be able to continue. A lot of damage for uh, a lot of the dodges that started in the back that did not need that. What a way to start! I think that was what lap number three that it happened on. Somehow the fifth, the seventy-three rode around the seventy. Uh, 72. We gotta see this. We'll see what happened here. He was leading, now he's not. Oh, so this was coming to the yellow. Let's see where he got past. Oh. So, Shred, Ooh, three points leader, is going to lead laps here. Let's kind of speed it up here, get an idea. Yeah, he, he just did, did not have to get off the corner. No. 73 of Shred, looking to gain that points lead. Still get his first career win, too. Shred has not won a race. And exactly. oh, that was, oh, that was a lovely pass for first. Yeah, and then uh, Anthony McClure, you know, in that position he's in right now, uh, he needs That's points. Going to go to the pit road. So he's road. in good position right now. I'm going to go to the pit road real quick and exactly. turn on the uh, overtimes, just in case we need him. Yeah, can we get a rundown and see who's still in and who is out? Yeah, I'll pull that up here real quick. So, 
Let's go ahead and pull up our standings. So, uh, quite the laundry lit. Well, a few cars still out. So, that's, so at the moment, it's the 30, the 75, the 58, and the 51. Yeah, and then... Big one there has to be the 51. Yeah. Last week's winner also. Also, of the cut line, that may, uh... May hit, hurt him here. Not, not by a lot, but a lot to do good at Dega or Michigan. One of the two. And then uh, we also got to keep in mind some of these cars may out, are on our damage vehicle policy, like the 18, 22, 98, 11, uh, 07, 90. Um, they're all on our damage vehicle policy. They're help to uh, make sure they. Are up to speed, otherwise they're gonna have to get manually removed from the race. For the guys that are above the bubble of the cut line, yeah, Vince Freeze. It's time to go. There's no time to waste. Got to get every point you can. Yeah, Vince Freeze. He's gonna need to keep it up to speed, otherwise that will be a very painful end to this day. Same for uh, Matthew Hill. I think Nimrod and Jet did not get involved. Jet did get involved, but not a whole lot. But Nimrod is good. We go agree yeah, this time. I think... Yeah, I didn't think Nimrod hit anyone. They should have slowed down, but I don't know about the others. There's Nimrod. Nimrod, no damage. Uh, 19, no damage either, but Vince Freeze, uh, the 90 and the 1. The hey, 1. He, he was in that. Vince Freeze was in that. Yeah, he was, oh, so. Oh, Clifton was in that. Uh, 43, he caused that. Caused it, wasn't in it, but. Uh, the right now, the concern for manual DNF is everyone in this pack except for the 19, 29, and 07. 98 didn't look like they get a whole lot of damage. We'll see how the run goes. 22 currently the biggest concern, seeing he does not have a hood, and that is going to definitely affect him with drag. And then Vince Freeze also heavily damaged as well, just slight damage to the 90 and 1. So a couple there, dodges there are going to have to be careful, make sure they're able to keep up the pace. The, so the hood a bent a little on the uh on the 11 of Vince Freeze he may have arrow damage all right yeah, so he's gonna be at a disadvantage all right we'll see That's we have to see this restart here 54 is be careful not get a restart violation he needs a good finish for his standings he cannot get a restart violation and it if he does it cost him quite a few positions um remember car length in between the leader and he at the line is the rule. Is the rule. Yeah, pace, car, pace cars off, they come to the restart zone. Uh, I, the lead by Andy I think he's good. Ooh, yeah, that's, he's just now at a car length, good, so I think Anthony he's McClure good. with a good jump takes the lead. They half on turn number one. Shred, Shred had a bad restart there, which gives Anthony McClure the lead. Bristol winner. Again, another one here tonight. Where Xustre are uh, captain consistency. Three wide for second. Of three wide for second again. He's Love making, it. Man, you can go three wide. Remember, go four on this wide. Track, the draft was very important. Fox tried sending it. Here comes Patatenha. Indianapolis with oh, a whole lot of laps there. The inside, here. Yeah, the three way battle for fifth. If he squeezes the in the inside. middle. And now we got a battle for the lead. Looks like I it is. Back to the lead. He's going to hold on to it on this lap. But there's going to be a run at the bottom on the, on the pavement. 48 went for it. Side against it. Never mind. Did I see back it. there that's Eric Monko, me, going for second on Fox Cozart. Cozart. Get it. The Tottenham, I'll the 71. Second, but... Oh, it's going to be another three wide, but it's going to be for third. Nunez. What? Victor Nunez in the 20. Takes third. Oh, car in the walls, 54. Oh, that's McClure. I was McClure in the wall. He'll keep a bye, but he'll lose a lot of spots. That is not good for those point standings. Meanwhile, Levette and me take all away from third, but Victor Nunez may, may catch up. I noticed there were four wide. I noticed there were four wide. There couldn't help but cut to it. And there's still four wide. Oh, there, there might be four wide there. Not gonna be good. If they can save it. They 
Oh, and I'm I do. St I'm still oh. concerned. We'll see if we can stay green, but I'm still concerned about where they're running. We'll see. So far, a few calls are off base, but inside. now we got a battle for the lead between Monaco and Ez. Neither of these drivers have won a race. Monaco goes for the lead. He's going to hold on to the bottom. He's going to take it and not the first car. Back the entire top He's five. He's going to lead laps. Other than Marco the 83. Number 12 on the 13. It's got oh, Victor here comes Nunez. Oh. Battling with the vet. Slow down Monaco. Here comes Nunez to the inside. He's looking. A diving oh, in here. Looking to run down the back stretch. Turn number three. Monaco with a late break out. Turn number four. He'll keep the lead for now. Look who's lurking. Outside the top run. Up to nine. He's going to make this battle more interesting as well. Here comes yeah, Nunez for the lead. For the lead. Nunez takes Nunez the lead. Nunez versus Nunez. Monaco. Oh. Here comes Thunder of 24. He's going to send it. Maybe three. Nunez takes the lead. We'll lead lap number, number 14. Here comes Thunder 24 fan. For second, Monaco... Playing all the way back to fifth, he may drop down. Ooh, that was nearly three wide there, but he bags out of it a little bit. Here comes the 63. Some Dan. He keeps it at Some the Dan. bottom. Nunez gets and a little bit of a gap, but I think the drafts are going to pull him, the others back in. A little argy barty between Frank and whoever's in the red and white dodge, but that's a moon man oh, 101. Oh, moon man, three wide. Oh, Shredding 72 Thunder sending man. it. Oh, Thunder 24 man, Ooh, monsters coming in too. But we have Sun Dan and Nunez battling for the lead. Moon man, right? I there. think on the inside. That there's also a battle for Ooh, third two two. Sam Dan takes the lead. Out turn number two. Here, here comes the one, 101 car. That is Moon Man. Some Dan versus Moon Man. Dan and Man Show, if you call it. Some shred for third there. He's using his moon power to get least into the draft with Sun Dan. But here comes Shred, who is also... And with the big dive right there, able to get to the 101, but will, will he be able to dive in turn three? Ooh, he's going to send it in for a second, but he decides to... A little bit of a hard block. block. Moon Man shuts the door and Shred. Here comes the 33 Mountain Dew Chevy. As a monster, and behind him is teammate of Nimrod. Monster Nimrod... They're kind of either. They might be drafting together for a little bit, but. Working together here could possibly be a threat for the lead here. Is that Jimmy? No, that's not Jimmy. Who's in the 99? That's Potato Boy in the 99. Oh, Potato Boy. He's really looking at the spoiler. He gets shuffled back. Look at the standings here. No. The, uh, he definitely lost the draft on that one. 22 in the yeah, 90. Think... 22 in the 90 are no longer on pace to finish the race. They are losing a second lap, and they will not be able to finish. So far, Sundan does have a little bit of a gap, but... Since this track is mostly drafts competency, I don't think it's going to last for too long. So focused on this, so that we couldn't focus on the guys that could end it. And look at this, our spring oh. winner. Sam Oskin won here in the spring. It could get it again. He, he's in fourth. He's in condition. Also, I didn't realize until now, we're almost done already. It's about... Almost three laps, to, almost uh, 
Uh, five laps to go. Hamdan leads it. The race has been so good, we forgot how many laps to go. Yeah. So Hamdan is on his line. Hamdan, it's almost the same situation there with from last week. Brock Lelson. This time it's some dam with the points later behind him. But here comes Nimrod for second. Gets a good little push down on the back stretch. And Sam and Oskin. Um, Hard to go this time by. Oskin's in position to win, to go to sweep here at Kansas. And we got four laps to go. Oh, but there's the. There's someone coming Sun up Dan. behind Craig, Craig Pockereth in the 64, or in the 46. The numbers touched up, my bad. Bud drops down the fifth, going to be challenged by Thunderman 24 fan. Thunder 24 fan. I believe that's the battle for fail for six. There were five laps worth. I think we're at go. three laps to go. So far, their nose to tail. Ooh, battle for a second. For a second. Here we go this time. We'll make, make the pass. As here we come. Two, two, two to go. Some Dan. And Oskin. Maybe going to get for a second here. Get second on Nimrod. Here he comes for the lead. Oh, Oskin definitely got a go. good run off that corner. Here he comes Oskin for the lead. Knows it's time to go. Oskin wants to sweep here at Kansas. There he goes for, the, in, for the lead. Here they come he hooks it. Four. White flag. White flag in the air. It's going to be Sam and Oskin, or is it going to be some Dan? Remember, Sam and Oskin, blue an engine at, at Pentacola. You know he wants to win in any capacity, any series, any capacity. Oh, he wants his win because it definitely helps him out in the standings. On the back stretch they go. Oh, nice little run on the back stretch. He pulls away. They come out turn number four. And Sam and Oskin will complete the Kansas sweep here at Kansas. How about that? Sam and Oskin sweeps here at Kansas. Again, Shred. Finishes second, runner-up, back-to-back. That's going to be good for their points lead. That is bank. It's your top ten there. Oh, and, and, and as I look at the standings, look, look, at, look who's in tenth. Alex Tanker. Good That's going to help him in the standings. Exactly. <laughs> I said he so needed a good run, and there it is, a top ten for... Alex Tanker heading into Dega. Good point stay for Alex Tanker. He's going to love this. Congratulations, Sam and Hoskin. That's the, that's the sweep here at Kansas. Tread once again goes runner up. Who's going to stop Shred? He, he hasn't won a race this season, and he's pretty much clinched it by now. Punch the season points championship. Let's see if, how he'll hold up in the round of 16. <laughs> but based on this consistency, he's he's already he will stay the mo driver of most top tens this season as no one has surpassed 10 except for him. He's at 11. Uh, two second place finishes in a row. He's just got one more position. He'll finally get his first win, but just hasn't quite gotten it yet. He's close, but not close enough. But how about that? Uh, Kansas sweep. Yep, uh, we've seen uh, uh, Garth Salamander do that in Las Vegas um, in 2021. I don't think we've seen much anything else like that. Tripsy Shy may have a similar statistic at this track in the Cup Series. We'll have to double check that, but uh, we'll see. But uh, other than that, this is Zach 103 TV, the uh, NCRS at Kansas uh, Fall. And uh, this one was actually pretty good. Took what it is and uh, we'll see you next week at Talladega. Cup Series will be going here as well. And well, I guess I probably should have did the outro a little bit better but for me, Eric Monaco and Dark X Rain. Reggie was in here briefly. This is the NCCRS. Peace out.